It's not uncommon to experience a little rain on the Mendocino coast, but don't let it ruin your experience. Head to one of the places where rain enhances your experience. Well, it's the Disneyland of rocks. John Bartel here, making a little pit stop at Stone Ranch. Uh, water over rock is just a beautiful thing. Stone Ranch is a unique 50-acre property overlooking the little town of Wallala. And if you take a tour with resident artist Amanda Stinson, she will for sure tell you all about the creator, the late Peter Mullins. Stone mad rock guy, just like in love and obsessed with rocks. With the help of artists, Peter built more than 30 stone installations for visitors to explore on the property. Some tall, some short, and some kind of unfinished. This is called the pergola, or as we sometimes jokingly call it, the pergoles. If you get up close to many of the rock structures, you'll notice something. There's nothing holding them together. Tell me there is no like mortar or glue or anything holding this together? Well, that's right. Huh, so, I mean, is it even safe to stand under this thing? <laughs> well, that's the beauty. It is safe because there is more wiggle room and dry stack. Dry stack is kind of what it sounds like. Rocks stacked or wedged on top of each other. It's an ancient style of building with rocks that hold up even in earthquakes, according to Amanda. We just had a 4.1 back in May, and the only thing that fell was a rock balance that I had done that actually had been up for like five years. Many of the rock installations are interactive, meaning you can walk on or walk through, and touching is highly encouraged, especially in the rain. I ran over just now. Whoa, I didn't even realize it was brown, because when it's dry, it, it's more of a gray. Genevieve Mullins is Peter Mullins' daughter. She says her dad designed the place to interact with nature. His prized masterpiece is the Fish Rock Tower, which also interacts with the rain. It is uh, made with a hot lime mortar that strengthens every time it rains. Genevieve says her father never could have built this place without other rock-loving artists. He had an act for inspiring people. This is a space for artists to create, and that is something that my dad always wanted. Peter Mullins passed away in 2022, but left behind a rock-solid legacy for all of us to enjoy, no matter the weather conditions. Where when you're snuggling up to a rock, you're just like snuggling all of this, all of these years, these hundreds and thousands and millions of years, which is just incredible. From Stone Ranch in Wallala, I'm John Bartell. Hope to see you on the back roads.